Hey guys, it's John B. here with Tom's Guide. I'm here at the Apple event for the iPhone 15. I'm gonna check out the iPhone 15 and 15 Plus, talk about what's new, what's different, what's big about it, and of course, give you all my thoughts. All right, so here we are, the iPhone 15, 15 Plus, 6.1 inches versus 6.7 inches. That's honestly the difference. If you like a bigger phone, go with the 15 Plus here. They have the aluminum frame. Nice polish, feels good in hand. Surprisingly, they're both lightweight. I'm kind of jealous about the iPhone 15 versus the uh, Pro because they have the better looking colors, the more colorful. Unlike the other, you know, 15 Pro, you get black, metallic, gray, whatever, but beautiful, gorgeous displays. Like I said, 6.7 inches on the uh, iPhone 15 Plus. Really bright and vibrant. Now, what's new, the first thing here you can see that's different is the dynamic island. Now, this comes from the iPhone 14 Pro last year. So now you have detailed information, quick glances, notifications, useful, handy. So that's the first big difference here. Second big difference here is the bottom. You have the new USB-C port. Gone is lightning. Hey, more, more compatibility with different accessories. 10 gigabits per second transfer speeds from what they say here. Third big thing here I'm gonna tell you here is the camera on the back. Both phones have a new camera sensor, which is great. Basically inherits the iPhone 14 Pro camera. So you have a 48 megapixel camera. Now, at first you'll see it's a dual camera setup here. So you have your main camera paired with your ultra wide, but they do something really special and they kind of give you a third camera, a two times zoom lens. So technically telephoto covers the ranges, which is really nice, lots of versatility. If you're a content creator, you go really wide, very close or very you know far away. Checking out the new post focusing effect here on the iPhone 15 main camera. So basically take a photo and then later, in the app, you could choose, of course, the focus. So, of course, changing the aperture right there, f1.4, really blow out the background. But if I want the other person in the background in focus and the person in, in the foreground out of focus, you could do that, which is what I like about this. You could shoot now, worry later. Now, these phones are going to be available very shortly, and the starting price is going to be $799 for the iPhone 15, and of course, 100 bucks more, 900 bucks, 899 for the iPhone 15 Plus. Three things that stand out to me, again, with the iPhone 15, you have the dynamic island, you have the A16 Bionic chip, and also that 48 megapixel camera. So essentially, you're getting the iPhone 14 Pro, but at the cheaper iPhone 15 price. So if you want to learn more, check out our website, tomsguide.com. I'm John V. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook, and I'll see you in my next video.